Chemotaxis is a migratory process of a bacterial cell driven by a chemical gradient. Bacterial cells use flagellar motors to move around. Flagella can turn in a counterclockwise motion which would result in a run, can also turn in a counterclockwise motion resulting in a tumble. The action of both running and tumbling can help move a cell closer to a chemical stimulus such as food. Chemotaxis also occurs via various proteins. I will begin by explaining the role of each of the proteins in chemotaxis and then illustrate how the process occurs. The first transmembrane protein is known as a methyl accepting chemotaxis protein or better known as MCP. MCP interacts with two proteins, KW and KA. KA is a sensor kinase that autophosphorylates when MCP is activated by an attractant. It is responsible for transferring phosphoryl groups to both proteins KB and KY. The other protein, KW, assists with the interaction between KA and MCP. Next we have KY, which is a response regulator. It is phosphorylated by KA and dephosphorylated by KZ. A phosphorylated KY will move towards the flagella, governing its direction in either a clockwise or counterclockwise motion, resulting in a tumble or run. KB is a response regulator that is responsible for demethylating MCP. As previously mentioned, KZ is responsible for dephosphorylating KY, allowing it to be reset. This brings us to our last protein, KR, which works by methylating MCP. Let's see how this works. In the first scenario, the attractant is not bound to MCP, stimulating KA to autophosphorylate itself using ATP. KA will then donate its phosphate group to KY, which moves it towards the flagella, causing the flagella to rotate in a clockwise motion that would result in a tumble. KZ will then take a phosphate off KY, allowing it to be regenerated. Throughout this process, KR will slowly methylate MCP, and KB, which is phosphorylated by KA, will remove the methyl groups at a faster rate. In the second scenario, MCP is bound to an attractant, decreasing autophosphorylation of KA, and as a result, decreasing phosphorylation of KY and KB. Thus, the demethylase activity of KB will decrease, meanwhile, KR methylation activity will increase. As previously mentioned, phosphorylated KY will interact with the flagella, only this time, it will cause the flagella to rotate in a counterclockwise direction, resulting in a run.